All right, so let's solve a problem which appeared in JMA in 2025. This question is asking us to find out the sum of all possible values of alpha, where alpha is part of this vector. So there are three points uh, in the x y plane given by A, B, C. And then what we have to find out is that, that we have to find the angle bisector of O and O, B and the distance of point C from this angle bisector line. And then the sum of all possible values of alpha at the end, right? So alpha is actually part of this. So many a times what you would find when the question is given an XY plane, and then um, if you convert it into a coordinate geometry problem, this is easily solved. So that is what we'll try to do over here. So if you look at this and then look at the points like A and B, so A is having the point uh, root three and one. So there's a point like root three and one over here. And then, this is the point A. And then if you're looking at point B, then this point is over here, which is B, which is one comma root three. So if you're looking at the line, which is sort of passing through OA, so this is the one which is passing through OA. And if you're looking at this line, which is passing through OB, then there will be the angle bisector of it, which is there. And then we have to find out the distance of this point C, which is somewhere, somewhere, I, we don't know really. So A and one minus A. And then we have to find out this distance, which is given as nine by root two. So we have to find out which all values of A is possible. Like the a other point could be over here, here or here, anywhere, right? So if we find out this equation of this line and then, then we know, right, that we can drop a perpendicular from here and find this distance then we'll be able to find you now whatever is given. So if you look at very closely, this line is having a slope 30 degree because as you can see, uh, this part would be x, which is root three. If you're looking at this, this is root three and this is one. So you can say that tan 30 degree, right? That will be giving you one upon root three, right? So this is 30 degree. And if you're looking at this, this is 60 degree in the same manner. So the angle bisector of this will be passing like this, which is 45 degree, right? So the equation of this line is simply y equals to x. So y minus x equals to zero is this equation of the line. If I'm dropping a perpendicular from him or finding the distance d, which would be mod of a minus one minus a, uh, oh, the other way around actually, it should be, I should be writing more like x minus y equals to zero. So we can write it like this. Doesn't matter because this was a mod, but still. So A, uh, and then we could set one minus A, right? And divided by um, square root of one square plus minus one square, so one square minus one square. So the numerator would become two A minus one. The denominator will become root two. And this is given equal to nine by root two. This is given equal to nine by root two. So root two root two cancels. And I can say that then two a minus one is actually equal to plus minus nine. So the one value of two a would be minus one goes to this side if I take nine. So nine plus one and the other value will be two a minus nine and plus one. So I get one value as two a equals to 10 or a equals to five. I get another value as two a equals to minus eight and a equals to minus four. Right, so if you look at these two, sum of these two, a, uh, a is two values, which will be plus five minus four, and which will come out to be one. So that is what is your answer here. So plus five minus four, which is one, and that is option number one, right? So this question can be solved uh, using coordinate geometry easily. Many times you will find such a question to be solved and then you try to get back to coordinate geometry and solve it, and that would be much easier for you. All right. So that's all for this question. If you've got any queries, do ask me in the comment section below. I'll be happy to answer your queries. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a good day.